Hello everybody, my name is Ultra Gamer J, and welcome to Ark the Lad Twilight of the Spirits. Just, ask for some standard, or just your standard, you're just letting you know from the beginning, I am not going to be talking during cutscenes or trying to voice any of the characters in a non-voiced cutscene or what have you, because I tried that in a dry run and, well, it sounded a lot better in my head. Hopefully, right now, I don't sound like too much of a jackass, but that's not why you're here. You're not here to listen to me talk. You're here to watch me play this game. So, let's get right down to it. All right. Ready? Let's go, Lloyd. Card, you can do it. All right. Let's begin. You're showing a lot of improvement. Hang on. We're not finished yet. How's that? Uh, well done.
All right, let's now actually get to some exploration of this place. Now, just a heads up from the get-go, the first three videos are going to be pretty exposition heavy. We're not going to get into any actual fighting until around the fourth episode. I apologize for that, but what are you going to do? And if you notice any, I'm, as I'm sure you'll notice at some point, there are some move problems with how fast I move or something, that's a technical issue due to the equipment I'm using. Uh, what, what you gonna do, am I right? So, anyways, when I first saw Banjo's name, I didn't know whether to refer to him as Banjo the Instrument or Banjo like Ryuga Banjo from Kamen Rider Build. I'm gonna go with the latter because it sounds more respectful. Anyways, let's get down. Let's get back to the game. Yeah, that's not your choice to make, Karg. And as and just so we get this out of the way, there's no way we can go through this gate yet. But we will at some point. We will. Because that's how games like this work.
Oh, I see how it is, Paulette. You don't want us to leave until we do this obligatory side... Or this obligatory plot point. Yeah, I see how it is. By the little bit of minor trivia, the person voicing Karg is the same guy who did Marcus Damon in Digimon Data Squad. Or Digimon Savers for those purists out there. I did not know that until I looked it up on IMDb. Yeah, when I first heard, I'm like, is that freaking Marcus? And, to my surprise, it was. If this is Karg's bedroom, I'm, I'm kind of underwhelmed. I mean, uh, from all the RPG games I've played, I expected a protagonist's bedroom to look a bit more interesting. And we're probably going to put a stop to things right here because we're going to have another cutscene and a whole lot more to go through. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed your time with me here. Once again, I'm Ultra Gamer J. Remember to like and subscribe for more videos, and I hope to see you, you soon again soon.